Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So, in my Closer Look video, I mentioned that I didn't want to do Realm of Legends Winter Soldier because that doesn't really showcase Silver Surfer to his best, you know? We did a Freezer Burn path instead. But, I still want to fight Winter Soldier. He's a great benchmark uh, for a lot of champions, even though it's not the best for Silver Surfer. And it's tradition. I didn't want to break the tradition. So this first fight is against Winter Soldier. You'll notice that I parried, fired off a heavy. That gives me the power gain right off the bat so that I can build up my power bar much, much quicker. All right, got the power cosmic buff up right now. And I'm just waiting out, waiting out. Um, fired off a special one in order to get the two stacks of the armor. And I don't know if I uh, mentioned this, but the armor up buffs are actually pretty substantial. Uh, I didn't give them enough play when I did my closer look video. I kind of was like, well, those aren't the ones that are exciting. It's the fury and the power game. Not so. So with these armor up buffs, I want you to notice the damage that he takes. He doesn't take a lot of damage, all right? So he's got these up and I believe I'm gonna go ahead and fire off or let him fire off a special two here. Yep, there we go, look at his damage. That was not a lot of damage at all. You guys know when you have uh, champions that don't have great block proficiency and you take Winter Soldier's hits and see like right there, he didn't have the armor up so he took more damage. So those armor ups are actually very, very useful. Now, I'm still getting used to fighting with Silver Surfer. You know, he has, he's very simple, but one of the things that will mess me up, and you'll see it in the later uh, fights, is I take my eyes off of my opponent to look to see what buff is rotating. And since I'm still not you know, familiar and comfortable with the sequence and everything, you know, I should be able to glance up, look at where it's at, and then know what I need to do, have those timers in my head. That takes practice. But until then, what's happening is I'm taking my eyes off my opponent, I'm looking up there, and then I'm like, okay, so now, you know, and I'm watching it a little bit too long, and I usually get hit because of it. You know, even if I'm holding block, doesn't matter, he'll fire a heavy off. Now, you saw me getting hit there, but Winter Soldier, normally he does, you know, quite a bit of damage, but Silver Surfer can take it. So when we looked at Silver Surfer in the closer look and I saw the block proficiency, I was like, ooh, that's usually an alarm. But what Kabam often does, not always, but often does, is the champion will have some way to compensate. So you get low block proficiency, but then through abilities, possibly just synergies, you can make up for it. And with Silver Surfer, that is the armor ups, okay? So down goes Winter Soldier. And as you'll see throughout this video, Silver Surfer is not really suicide friendly, okay? Not suicide friendly. Uh, in order to use him to his fullest, you're gonna need to fire those specials. Now you can play around it a little bit, you know, firing off a heavy instead, but you know, he's really not suicide friendly. So you see the team that I'm going in here with, we're going into act 616, and we're gonna fight this Moon Knight first and then Havoc next, and then we're gonna have an Ultron fight at the end to finish off the video. So this first fight, we've got Hurt Locker as the global, but that's it, really. Um, you just can't do two specials same in a row. If you do, you need to fire off a heavy. Now, you see here, my parry failed. Um, I had the wrong timing, whatever. Uh, so I didn't get that parry heavy to get the power gain. So instead I have an armor up buff here because I still wanted to get some buff up. Okay, so here we go, we're going in. 
I fired off my special one. Now I've got two stacks of the Fury. All right. And so I'm just like, all right, let's get in here. Now, if you noticed on the team, I had Heimdall and Guillotine. That was so that I could dash back, hold, and get a precision buff. But you'll notice that I keep forgetting to do that. Um, uh, in, in other fights, I forget to do it. So uh, it was kind of a waste, but I just wanted to show you guys that that was the strategy, even if I didn't uh, follow it all the way. Okay, I was kind of salty there. I'm like, man, if I had had a few more crits, then he would have been dead right now and I wouldn't have taken that recoil damage. Like I said, he's not really suicide friendly. All right, so now we've got Moon Knight down. Havoc. So I remember when people were first initially trying to do this, they were looking for counters to this Havoc because that plasma will eat you alive. Those plasma detonations, no joke. So in order to counter Havoc, you need to power drain him or have an armor up buff. Well, it just so happens that Silver Surfer does have armor up buffs. So we wanna test out and see if that works. All right, so you'll notice I didn't do the parry heavy because I'm waiting until like right now so I can get that armor up buff right there, okay? So that should protect me from the uh, plasma detonation here, okay? So I got the power cosmic up right here, all right? I got hit, but you see it didn't do a lot of damage. And there we go, fired off the special one. Now I've got two stacks of the armor up. I should be safe, all right? You see plasma detonations? Look at those plasma detonations. They're going like crazy, it's not hurting me, okay? So armor up buff works. So if you're gonna fight this Havoc and you have Silver Surfer, he's also a good counter uh, for Havoc, but you have to remember to get those armor up buffs up quickly, like first. I didn't do that in one of my attempts. It was not pretty. I went in here, did my normal rotation of a parry, fired off a heavy, and I had the power gain up, and his plasmas tore me up. Just look at this sloppy, uh, you know, gameplay here. You know, I'm getting hit by his specials left and right, but look at Silver Surfer's health. That's the thing you wanna take away from this. You know, don't look at my gameplay, all right? And see, he blocked all of that. You know, bad gameplay. But I wanted to get back to the um, special one here. All right, because I didn't want the armor ups to fall off. So I fired off a heavy because it didn't look like he was going to fire his special off. All right, now I'm waiting for the power cosmic. All right, and I have to fire a special two. Um, well, not a special two, sorry. Um, I have to fire off a special three because of Hurt Locker or else I will get demolished. All right. Uh, so we fired off that special three and skadoosh, Cav Havoc is down. And that's how you do it. Look at Silver Surfer's health at the end of this fight, despite me playing badly. Okay, look at that. Nine hits I took and Silver Surfer is almost full. That is impressive. Now, a little behind the scenes, right now, um, I've got something to do. I gotta take my mom to an appointment and I'm rushing, okay? That's my excuse. Because what you're about to see right now is the sloppiest Silver Surfer gameplay ever, all right? So I wanted to do this path because of that shock, you know? And I'm like, okay, I wanna see what uh, Silver Surfer how he can handle that. So first off here, parry, heavy, normal. Got my power gain up. Now I'm going in and I'm a little confused here. I'm like, okay, why am I taking uh, that damage? And then I'm like, oh yeah, that's right, Spectre. Because Spectre reverses healing and I have willpower. So while I have the debuff, I would normally be healing but Spectre is hurting me, okay? So I'm like, oh boy, 
I definitely didn't think about that. So now I'm just like, well, let's just go. Let's go. Let's see if we can't get him down anyway. Sloppy though we are and, and you know, wasn't the best idea here. Look at that. He evaded right in there. He's pounding on me. I don't even have the armor ups up. And I'm just like, okay, look at him evading like he's Spider-Man. Now he's got that. I did an armor break on him. And I'm just like, okay, Heimdall, where are you? There it is. Heimdall, save the day. Hail Mary. Doom, 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 doom. Boom. And we got him down. Clutch play, ugly play, the sloppiest gameplay you're going to see. But that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.